There are issues sometimes that require all of us to give and take a little bit, and this is one of those. But if we don't find a solution soon, we are driving people that have lived in Idaho their whole lives and through no actions of their own are being forced out of their homes. Well, after a long and animated debate, a bill granting a one year property tax freeze to Idaho homeowners has passes another hurdle this morning. House voted 46 to 23 to send Representative Mike Moyle's bill to the Senate. The majority leader's bill would, in essence, not allow an increase in the property tax portion of local government budgets for one year. You're still going to have to pay property tax this year, but it will be at the same rate as it was last year. And this bill has been widely criticized and opposed by some city leaders like Nampa Mayor Debbie Kling and state representatives like John Gannon. It's time to face the real issue. And the real issue is that the property tax system has morphed into an unjust and unfair system that no longer works. And when our property taxes are going up in double digits every year for three years in a row, it's not working. Again, it did pass the full house, now heads to the Senate. Representative Moyle says he hopes this whole year that they take it off if it goes through and gets all the way to the governor's desk. We'll give them a chance to kind of talk about property tax in a more in-depth discussion. Well, you can catch our previous interviews with both Nampa Mayor Debbie Kling and Representative Mike Moyle. They are there right now at KTVB.com and on our 208 Facebook group.